It's fair to say that tension levels have been heightened as we get ready for this semi-final here at the 2022 World Cup. My name is Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me, providing expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. And a special atmosphere for this very special contest. It's England up against Portugal. Well, this could be an absolute classic, and the prize couldn't be any bigger, could it? A place in the World Cup final. Let's just hope we get two teams that want to play good football and come out and attack the opposition. The England first 11. Jordan Pickford is the keeper. Kieran Trippier starts alongside Luke Shaw as fullbacks. Jordan Henderson starts alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Harry Kane. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Rui Patricio is the keeper. Joao Cancelo starts with Rafael Guerrero as fullbacks. Ruben Neves plays alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. Well, you get the feeling when you watch Harry Kane that he dedicates himself daily to being the best player he can be. Stuart, what do you... Kane! Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions. And then it's a top-class strike from Kane. His technique is absolutely spot-on. Just look at the power he generates here. He has teammates around him. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder, but he's still got so much work to do. Just look at the strength he shows to hold off the defender and still get his shot away. That's a really good finish. Playing it short. Leal. Opportunity missed. It's a promising move from Portugal. And they could get one back here. And there is the goal. Well, that changes the equation. And they have the momentum now. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding, but should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. And the threat on the counter-attack is very real. Here they come again. Well, just watch this again. Grealish's pass is inch perfect. Then it's a top-class strike from Sterling. His technique is absolutely spot on. Just look at the power he generates here. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. Well, decent save there. The referee blows for full time. And guess what? England are through to the World Cup final. Well, they won most of the individual battles all over the park today. And that was key to their comfortable win in the end. 
It was a really composed display in a very important game, and they'll certainly fancy their chances in the final. Well, he caught the eye at times in this particular match, didn't he, Stuart? Well, he didn't have his best game, but he still played a part in the team's victory. He certainly made a contribution.